And now we're just going to do a quick tutorial on how to crop a photo in Photoshop. If you go over to the left hand side of the screen, you'll see the crop tool. If you leave the mouse hovered over the tool, it will show you crop tool. If you click and hold, you'll also see that you have the slice and the slice select tool. Depending on the version of Photoshop, you may have other or neither of those options. However, let's say you go over here and you can't find the crop tool. Well, it's good to know, even though we don't use the slice or slice select tool, that it is in fact where the crop tool can be found. And that's it. You go ahead and select your crop. You can adjust the width the height, or if you grab a corner, the width and the height at the same time. Click return or enter to complete the crop, and that's it. Well, here are a couple of issues you might run into. Let's say that there are some numbers in these fields up here, width, height, and resolution. Okay, Let's go back to our original image here. And you'll notice that when I move the mouse around, it won't actually let me crop the way I want to crop. Well, that's because these fields up here, if I hit escape, if I get rid of that box, these fields up here are, are filled in. Um, we don't ever want to crop and resize in the same fell swoop. So what we're going to do is just delete those three, and that'll allow us to crop however we want. Well, what if we want to crop to a square? Well, we can do that, right? If I hit escape, if I hold down the shift key, you'll notice that that little bo uh, box actually becomes a box, a perfect square. If I let go of the shift key, it'll allow me to crop freely and then hold down the shift key, it'll jump to a box. If I want to crop to a box, I can crop to a box. Hit return, and that's how you crop in Photoshop.